What's up guys, Albert with Ballista, and today we're going to do a review on the BL33 Spincast Reel. So to start off, as you can see, it's fairly small. It's measuring in at four in inches and a quarter from the top of the reel to the bottom of the push button. So it's relatively small and compact. Uh, you can see it fits nicely in my hand, just like that. It's also made out of e-corrodible um, anti-rust materials such as stainless steel and alloy. Uh, the front colors are, are alloy cast and then the interior material is also stainless steel and other um, great materials that don't get rusty, which is very nice out here, especially if you're fishing in salt water. I would still definitely recommend rinsing it down because salt water just damages everything overall. But uh, you don't have to worry about it as much. So as you can see, there we have it. Nice quality material on the outside. Now, the the handle the is made out of nice rubber, and there's these nice grips in it that really just help you grasp it, and it just feels really nice in your hand. Very nice feeling in your hand. We also have adjustable pitch, obviously, which is your drag, uh, plus makes it tougher to pull on minus makes it looser I'm sure you guys are aware of how to use that now this reel has a 3.6 to 1 gear ratio and a 1 to 6 ball bearing so it's not the fastest reel however it really helps reel in those bigger fish um, that dead weight so that's that all right, what does it come equipped with and how much line can it hold? So your, the BL33 comes equipped with 45 yards of 50 pound um, braid. So this has been a good weight for me. I haven't had any issues with it, but if you are going after bigger fish like carp, um, you might want to upgrade your line and you are totally able to do that. You just take off the top uh, reel cover, Respool it. I'm sure most of you know how to do this and if you don't there's plenty of videos on YouTube about that so 50 pound test now the real capacity is uh, 60 yards max with 15 pound uh, test so the spool isn't huge however uh, You don't need much especially if you're bow fishing now. I kind of want to talk about that the reason we have this reel the spin cast reel is because it works phenomenal phenomenal with our bow fishing setup so as you can see really small nice and compact nice and compact uh, if you wanted to you can move this down further on the reel however this spin cast reel isn't only compatible with our products it's compatible with any regular fishing rod um, and it works great for fishing too so there's the push button boom just like that and then you can just reel up, right? Just like you would with any other reel. So pretty simple review. There's not much to it um, other than that, you know, it's very nice quality material. Uh, doesn't corrode in the salt water. Nice handle, feels great in your hands. But other than that, I mean, it's a reel. There's, there's not much to it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add some videos, some clips to this video of it in action of me bow fishing uh, just so you guys kind of get a real life grasp or in action um, with the reel. Check this out guys. Just came out here for a little walk. Nice, decently long shot. It was probably, I don't know. First shot. First shot, yeah, first shot right to the head. Um, I don't know, seven, eight yards. So pretty far, but great job. Knocked them cold. All right, so that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed some of those clips. I know it wasn't much, but that's all I got for now. Now, if you guys want to purchase one of these amazing little spin cast reels, I'll leave a link down below and you'll be able to purchase it there. If you liked those bow fishing clips and you're interested in getting the bat, 
I'll also leave a link down below and you can go to our website and read all about these um, awesome little crossbow. All right, so that's a wrap for the review on the BL33 spin reel. Don't forget, nice, compact, very nice material, doesn't rust, uh, great gear ratio, and it does a wonderful job reeling in those bigger fish. All right, I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.